Hello Taurus and welcome to your daily reading. If you're new to my channel, I hope you enjoy this video. I upload a new video every single day at 6am Brisbane time. I also have an exclusive Taurus channel that you may also enjoy. I'll pop a link up here for you. Now if you like daily readings you can always click the notification bell and tap all that way you won't miss an upload if you're returning to my channel a very warm welcome to you i'm so glad you're here with me today now let's go ahead and get some messages from your guides and your angels about friday what messages are there for my tourists today what messages are there? Ooh. Stay tuned at 12 noon today. I am uploading your weekend predictions reading. All right, straight up we have the magician. So someone around us or we are working on something new in our life. This is something that you are very experienced in. You have everything you need in order to create this new thing. Okay, whatever it may be, could be a business, could be a relationship that you're working on with another person. You have everything it takes in order for this to work out. Next up, we have justice. Okay, justice, it's so interesting. Look at the numbers. You got one, one, one. Okay, so justice is Libra energy. Justice is also about balancing something out. So the magician is saying you have everything it takes in order for this to work out. And justice is saying you may just need to chisel some things uh, in order to make the pieces fit uh, according to what you're trying to create. All right, let's keep going and get some more cards. Spirit, tell me more about this for my Taurus. What else does Taurus need to know? That's so interesting. We have the Emperor could be to do with an Aries energy. The Emperor is all about being a boss, being in your um, boss self, okay? Your totally competent you know exactly what you need to do and you've taken it upon yourself to be responsible for this okay so the magician is about um, creating something okay you've already gone through the steps of making this happen now uh, you've grounded it but you just need to chisel it a little bit fine tune it so that it, it totally fits in what you're intending to create emperor is being in charge being in control of this new whatever it is that you're trying to create three of cups is a celebration so a job well done now three of cups is cancer and mercury energy cancer very emotional very loving very caring um, and mercury is all about communications and how we express it ourselves now this could be getting together with like-minded souls and celebrating a job well done talking about it and feeling really in unison with these people now alternatively it can be about uh, getting together with someone possibly an Aries in some cases or a Libra that may be in management for others of you let's keep going We've got Queen of Cups, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, female energy. However, Queen of Cups doesn't have to be a water sign. She may be someone that is going through an emotional phase right now. Okay, you, Taurus, may be going through an emotional phase right now. Okay, and a bit wary of other people because you don't want to be hurt uh this is also being in your intuition and your psychic self um it, it's like i'm now in my intuitive phase i'm trusting my feelings and i'm following my heart 
temperance is possibly your intuition telling you that you might need to be patient in some regards uh, considering what you're trying to manifest what you're responsible for what you're trying to chisel away and fine tune in regards to what you're working on or a relationship it may take some patience and some moderation okay uh, moderation is key your guides are saying for some of you this could be a situation that is uh, moving fast forward and may need to slow down just a tad now next up we have the hermit a virgo energy the hermit is Honestly, for those of you who are in a coupledom, this is ecstatic union. This is much like a twin flame connection, a tantric uh, union between you and another. Your souls totally belong together. Okay, and this is saying a retreat may be necessary. You just need to spend one on one time together uh, and just really be in each other's vibe uh, and feel each other's energy okay and just sit in that union in that togetherness so that is the hermit energy it's really all about getting together with that one person who you your soul is just calling out to when their soul is calling out to you because there is something there that needs to be explored on a spiritual wavelength now for others of you this could just be saying that in order to fine tune what it is that you're trying to manifest uh it might require some solitude in order to think about it to come up with uh, a good plan okay you may need to slow down and listen to your intuition and your heart soul we also have the wheel of fortune which, which is saying that if this is a love situation this union togetherness moment is going to take years forward quite positively it may indicate a cancer sign is around you that wants to travel towards you because a chariot is a vehicle now this could also be progress this may be helping you progress forward whether it is spending time alone and really contemplating and thinking Thinking, taking some time out being patient with yourself following intuition and your heart in regards to moving forward so this time alone in contemplation and reconfiguring the situation fine-tuning it is going to help you and assist you in moving forward okay now alternatively in a relationship this moment together is going to help you move forward as a couple next up we have the king of wands king of wands taurus is very much about a passionate energy around you king of wands is the master of passion master of desire king of wands around you is somebody who's been there and done that okay but it doesn't stop him from how he feels about you okay he desires you he wants to be with you and he's got his sights set on you could be a fire sign Aries Leo or Sagittarius you do have the Aries there and Sagittarius there now it doesn't have to be a fire sign it could just be a masculine energy around you that has um a lot of attraction towards you and would like to spend some time alone with you now if you are the masculine this is you encompassing all those beautiful characteristics i just said and you may have your sights set on a special lady now we have lots of correspondence lots of energy going back and forward between you and this person or if you are the masculine going back and forward between you and your special lady okay lots of energy could be telepathy could be emotional energy could be passionate energy uh, this is all about connections being made eth etherically okay Eth etherically <laughs> etherically what am i saying etherically so you might be making some special connections with each other especially if it's a soul to soul connection
Next up, this could also indicate messages, news, information that's being shared. Okay, and we end on the note of the alchemist, which is the very first card, which is all about manifesting, creating, grounding our thoughts and making them 3D beautiful Taurus now let's get Amira's love oracle and get some more guidance for you we have ha ah, how interesting twin flame and you just had the ecstatic union with the hermit so Taurus a soul to soul connection gifts this person wants to shower you with love presents gifts flowers wine um, you know maybe some you know it's just make you feel really nice some flowers i was gonna say uh some chivalry take good care of you now if you are the masculine you may be feeling this way about your special lady you just want her to treat her uh like your princess and she certainly feels the same about you uh true gem dating queen so if you're the masculine this lady around you is a true gem she's got a heart of gold she's a lovely person she's graceful she's beautiful and that may be you handing her some flowers and gifts okay making her feel amazing and the soulmate card came out too which is a very intense connection being twin flame and a soulmate so this is something that is going to be very very intense energetically that's why you feel that hermit energy that you really want to spend time in retreat in each other's uh, energy and just feel each other uh, energetically just be in each other's space and eight of wands a lot of energy flowing between the two of you even if you're not together physically you're just thinking about each other and creating a lot of uh, etheric ties to each other which is really beautiful okay Taurus let me know how this resonates and what this means to you stay tuned 12 noon today I post your weekend special reading and as always I send you so much love peace and light bye for now